Hello, this is me, Martin, with a video just for YouTube. Just for YouTube. Because I'm used to saying, you know, for Facebook and YouTube. But like, this video is just going to be just, be, like I said, for YouTube. So, I'm at home. I'm doing this on my phone. As you can probably tell. I'm sorry, I'm trying to keep my eyes on the screen here. Uh, it's first day here. It's just gone 12 o'clock in the afternoon. 12 p.m. now. I've been inside since Tuesday when I went to... um. Local and the boss, and I'm going to be staying home now for a couple of days. Now, to probably a, maybe the weekend where I might go into town, I might go out on the weekend, haven't decided yet. Mm. I've actually, I'm watching new tricks in the minute, season seven, but I've actually gone on mute at the minute so you can hear me talking. Uh, okay. What's the talk about? Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Um. God, I've it now. I'm trying to remember it. God, um, um, oh, because I'm on Tuesday. I went to Chester on not Chester. I went to Loop on Tuesday because. Sorry, not. Sorry, Loop. Yeah, Loop on Tuesday because Monday was a bank holiday and I went the bus. Because last couple of times I've been. Because last time I went to Loop, I went the train. So this time I went the bus. And on Monday, I'm going to be going to Chester. Maybe by train, maybe by bus. I haven't decided yet. Bus, and like I said, there's no need for me to go out now for a couple of days, so. But I do what I need to do on Tuesday. It was a bit odd though going to Liverpool on Tuesday. And because and, and the buses were more packed. Because Monday was a bank holiday, obviously, no one went out on a Monday, so everyone not go, usually would go out on a Monday, went out on a Tuesday. I see the centre was packed and oof. And coming back from the pub, I think, what was it, the, um, yeah, it was the X1. I think it was the X1, or was it the one Chester Wells? Yeah, Ch one Chester Wells. The bus was packed, the wood like a bus, especially at the top. It was rammed. I was glad when I got to, I was glad when I got to the, got to Airport bus station, so. Mm. Yeah, what else said? Uh, um. Let's go check someone here. Excuse me, man. Just want to see what's going to take place at Extreme Rules. WWE pay per view this year, 2020. Just want to see what's going to be taking place at the pay per view. Like I said, I still can't believe what WWE did, what they did to Bianca Blair when she got buried by Boom Becky Lynch, who beat her in 27 seconds. I'm sorry, that I disagree with, man. This, Okay, half the match, have a come out as a surprise. But half the match, at least the last 10 minutes, something like that. Was he? And come on, like I said, she's been champion since WrestleMania, and she gets buried like. Oh, still no matches taking place. No. Yeah, if I was Banker Blair, Blair, yeah, Banker Blair, yeah, I wouldn't be happy. And also, what I want to know is why was um, Sasa Banks taking out the match? Because Aston said why? Because he was wishing it would be Sasa Banks versus Bianca Blair at SummerSlam. He was advertised, actually. Advertised, so why was he taking out the match? His name was. Com why was Kamara taking out the match to be placed by Becky? Hmm. Okay, so WWE may not be doing too great in a minute, but I'd still not watch, watch that in AEW because I'm sorry. AEW will never be WWE, I'm sorry, but... Plus, if you've known that anyone knows how many former WWE wrestlers are now there, and how many veterans are there, uh, Chris Jericho, Cody Rhodes, Big Show, Jim a few, obviously JR, Jim Moss is there, who I think, this is just my opinion, there's actually several people have said that on YouTube, that maybe it's time for GR to stand down. Because, I mean, come on, because he is 68, 69, going to be 70 next year. Yeah, he's going to be 70 or so next year. Maybe it's time for him to step down, have a retirement from wrestling. Or at least be at the comedy business in any way. Anyway, so I'm watching new tricks. I'm watching season 7 at the minute. Season 7 disc. Like I said, be interesting to see what, what 
the twenty what the extreme was if you, what the what match is gonna be on it. I know what probably is gonna be on it though, Becky Lynch will be on it. Mandy Orton and then got what's his tag point of riddle? Who are now the tag team champions? I never expected that for them to be the tag team champions. And obviously Roman Reigns will be on it too. Reigns and Bobby Lashley. Hopefully the matches will be good. Oh, cause I would love to see some surprises at the pay per view because you don't always see it. Prices on Western pay per views anymore. It's rather predictable. Which is sad because I'd rather see um because I want to see unpredictability. Well, I would love to see again. It's thirty minute matches, Iron Man matches. I don't think you. I don't think you'll ever see sixty minute Iron Man matches again. Don't think you'll ever see that. This is a pay, but and like I said, um, NXT doing okay. Some old Joe back there. And trying to decide what else to I'm trying to decide here. Um... Oh, well, that's, that's it. Yeah, I would love to see um, Stephanie Man back on WWE television again. And Triple H and. I'm talking about Vince. Um, I like Vince. Yeah, but I think maybe it's time for Vince McMahon to stand down from the w- as chairman of the WWE, hand the reins over to his children and his son in law. Because. No offence, because I'm, I'm part of me, this is my opinion. I think he's part of the reason why people are going off WWE at the minute, because he's, he's, cause he's been in control for so long, he's a control freak over the career writing process. Maybe it's time for someone else to take over. Like I said, I do like you, Vince, and I respect you, but maybe it's time for you to step down. I mean, come on, you are 76 years old. Maybe it's time for you. So that, um, is Shane still working with the company? Uh, I think he is. Yeah, let your son, daughter Stephanie, and your son, not Chip Ray's Paul Levesque, you know, take over the creative team. Um, anything else? No.